All new at 530, 100 mentors will now be available to help first generation and at risk college students. 50 students at both Ivy Tech and Marion University will benefit from that council. RTV 6's Derek Thomas talked to the students, the mentors, and the company that's making it possible. The goal is to make sure that the women graduate. This cap and gown is on constant display here at Ivy Tech. 42 year old Josette Robinson has returned to school after losing her longtime job due to downsizing. She's now pursuing a degree in philanthropy. My dream and vision is to start a nonprofit agency that will help families um, to gain home ownership. Um, it will also teach them job skills. USA Funds has provided a $181,000 grant for a mentoring program for women like Robinson, who are first generation college students who may be at risk. Because of our focus on college completion with a purpose, tying your education to a productive career, we think that mentoring is one way that women can really get a good start, a good launch in their careers because they've learned from other successful women. Robinson is a single mother. Her 17 year old daughter Raquel is in high school. Trying to balance school life with home life, she might need some counsel she can get from a mentor like bank executive Natalie Guzman. Not knowing what you don't know. So I think that um, in my career, I, there's certainly been some pitfalls and challenges along the way, and you learn from those and you hope to help others from doing those same mistakes if you can. 20 year old Keela McKee is a communications major and is in line for a mentor, and she can't wait. I hope I get a mentor that's a pusher and a goal getter and you know she just has that um, personality like I do is vibrant and you know keep wanting other people to grow themselves. Because of the mentors students get a chance to see what life will be like after college. Hopefully they like what they see. Derek Thomas. RTV6. And Robinson says she can benefit from a mentor, but she is already making great strides. She is the Ivy Tech Student Government Association president.